small twin engine plane crashes shortly after takeoff from the airport on Catalina Island and sadly all five people on board were killed. Mario Ramirez is live in Long Beach with the latest on the investigation and recovery efforts. Mario. Sandra Roxia, good morning. We're now learning the, the plane involved in that crash registered to a flight school out of Santa Monica. Four passengers and the pilot all losing their lives. Take a look here at this map. It gives you an idea of where this all unfolded. Around 8 o'clock last night, that plane came down near the island's private airport, a little over six miles northwest of Avalon's business district. According to the FAA, the twin-engine Beechcraft 95 had just departed from the Catalina Airport, known as the Airport in the Sky built on a 1600 foot tall mountaintop. Sheriff's officials say the crash site is in rough, steep terrain and online logs show the aircraft got a short distance from the runway before dropping off radar coverage. And that's when sheriff's officials say they received an automatic SOS message from one of the victim's cell phones with GPS coordinates. Now, details are still coming in about the crash, but this is what we've learned about the tragedy so far this morning. While at the site, five people, all adults, were located and pronounced dead. The the wreckage of that twin engine plane sits about a mile west of the Catalina Airport, where federal investigators are now on the scene, and the recovery operation resumed this morning after being suspended overnight because of visibility issues. The identities of those four passengers and the pilot have yet to be publicly confirmed. NTSB investigators, as well as the LA County Medical Examiner, continue to work the crash site. For now, that's the latest here in Long Beach. I'm Mario Ramirez. Back to you. All right, Mario, thank you for the update.